Every other Thursday, we're taking a look at a health issue or concern affecting many people, breaking down the information for you and telling you what you need to know to keep you healthy. And today's Ask a Doctor, Dr. Kalani Brady from the Johnny Burns School of Medicine, joins us to discuss expired medications and medicine. Good morning, Dr. Brady. Good morning, Kelly. Okay, I think it's something that most of us are guilty of. You know, you have medicine or medications that are in your shelf, in the drawer, that have been there for years. And for me, I see an Advil, don't look at the prescription and, or the ex expiration date and might pop them. But is that safe to do? Can you take expired medicine? It's not recommended. Uh, medicine over time can degenerate. So it's not as effective, and it actually can cause uh, other changes in the medicine uh, to make it uh, increase the side effects after the expiration date. Oh, interesting. And, and is there a difference between whether or not it's prescription versus over-the-counter medication? Uh, there are specific prescription medications where the expiration date is really important. An example are medicines for the heart, which should uh, you should pay attention to the expiration date for heart medicines and also eye drops. Mm -hmm. People who take eye drops, you should pay attention to the expiration date, which is right on the label for the medicine. Okay, good to know. And then what about over-the-counter medication? What are some common ones that people can sometimes let expire and but shouldn't? Um, Non-steroidal anti-inflammatories like Advil, Ibuprofen, Naproxen, uh, those medicines which are over-the-counter, uh, you need to pay attention to the expiration date. All right, and, and how often should you be checking your cabinet for the expired medications? What is the typical range for, for medicines that are like that, like the NSAIDs? Uh, at least a year. So if you check your uh, drug cabinet every three months, you're probably fine. Okay, and if you do check your medicine cabinet and you see that some things are expired, how exactly should you be disposing of them? Uh, you should not flush them down the toilet. <laughs> okay. You should return them to the pharmacy. And uh -huh. in fact, on October 23rd, we have the second annual Give Back Your Expired Medicine Day uh, where pharmacists will take your expired medications and safely dispose of them. All right, and perfect timing. Thanks so much, Dr. Brady. Again, this October 23rd, it's the National Prescription Drug Take Back Day of the Year. So check your medicine cabinets now. If there is something that is expired that you do need to get rid of in just a couple of weeks, it's the perfect time to make sure you're getting rid of them and in a safe manner. All right, any, yeah. last, any last tips for us in terms of expired medications, Dr. Brady? Um. There's no problem with checking it, uh, getting rid of expired medications, and replacing it with fresh medications that may work more effectively and not have side effects. All right, perfect. And of course, that's what we want, especially when we are taking medication to cure something or alleviate some pain. You want it to be as effective as possible. So make sure you have the freshest medications. Thanks so much, Dr. Brady, for joining us this morning. You're welcome, Kelly.